Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a review of my Angel Wine um, rocking chair glider. So I actually registered for this when I was pregnant with my first baby. I was looking for something, I, I didn't want to ask for a lot that was like too expensive. So I decided to put this on my registry because it was inexpensive and it was it said it was easy to assemble. So you could just check the video description for some more informational information on the Angel Line rocking chair glider. So this is perfect when you have a new baby and you're rocking them to sleep. Um, what I actually used this for was like the first couple months of um, after I had my son, I was uh, pumping a lot and trying to breastfeed. So I would do that mainly in this chair. Um, it's it's good for what it is, but I actually, so I'm about, right now I'm at like 142 pounds, I'm pregnant, but my husband is probably more like 250, and he sat on it, and he actually broke it. I don't know if you guys can tell from the video, but there is a piece that's broken, so it's really not made the best like it's a little bit cheaply made I would say so it kind of like goes down to the side I could still sit on it okay but he really can't I'm afraid I don't really let him you could see it's uneven like this side goes up higher than this side um, as far as putting it together that was pretty easy it squeaks just a little you could always use like a lubricant like a WD-40 um, Stains are, I don't know what that, I think that's like dried milk from like feeding the baby in the middle of the night. Um, but I, I've used like just a warm rag to try to get like the milk stains out. This one for some reason is kind of like not coming out, but I, I didn't really use it that much because my son by eight weeks was sleeping through the nights. So I really didn't have to rock him to sleep too often, just like when he was sick or not feeling well. But um, it's gotten like, you know, a good amount of use. I mean, I'm still happy I got it. But next time, you know, if you're someone that is going to be using um, a rocker glider a lot uh, for your baby, then maybe I would stick with something a little bit more sturdy and expensive. But it's not that bad. And you can see it doesn't take up too much room. I mean, I have it in like the corner. This room isn't really that big anyway. Um, my husband was able to put this together pretty easily and he's really not handy. So just so you guys could see like the bottom of this. <clears throat> and then it came with the footrest also, which I will show you. So it's pretty comfortable. Just put your feet on. So it's good when you're setting up because I spent a lot of time in here when I was pumping um, and I would be like watching TV, <laughs> just trying to relax, put my feet up. Um, it's good when you get home from the hospital if you're still very swollen, like my feet were very swollen for a while. So I definitely spent like a good amount of time kind of resting my feet. <clears throat> I just want to show you guys like the bottom of it. go on this side so you can see a little bit better um you were you were able to by the way buy a warranty if you want to so that would have been like covered um if I like told them you know it was broken you, you know it was broken like basically right after I got it when my husband sat on it they probably would have replaced it but I didn't purchase it um and then it tells you it's made from ottoman cushion, 100% polyurethane foam pad. Uh, very light. And this uh, rocks back and forth as well. So that's also a good thing when you're rocking the baby to sleep. Um, and my son likes sitting on my lap with it. Uh, it's also good for story time when he gets a little older and I really start reading books to him um you could sit you know with the baby in the chair and uh read books so it's good for that as well um I just I would really be careful with the weight like I said my husband you know kind of broke it and now it leans to one side 
and he just sat on it. And he's like a 250 pound man, but he, it's not like he was like negligent with it and like rough on it. He just sat down and it, and it broke. So, um, you really have to kind of be careful about how much weight you're putting on it. Um, I would say like probably not more than 200 pounds. So in a lot of cases, daddy can't <laughs> sit on the chair, which is a little rough, but, um, for what it costs, it's great. Um, for what it does, it gets the job done, but, um, the sturdiest, not, not the most. So, if I uh, had to take the option to purchase the warranty again, I absolutely would. So guys, this is my review of the Angel Line Rocking Chair Glider. I hope you guys found the video useful. If you did, please feel free to leave a comment and let me know. Thanks guys and have a great day.